बिस्मिल्लाम मेरे यूट्यूब फैमिली एंड फ्रेंड्स अस्सलाम वालेकुम वरहमतुल्लाहि वबरकातुह पीस बी अपॉन यू मे अल्लाह कीप यू ऑल सेफ साउंड पीसफुल रिलैक्स हेल्थी एंड हैप्पी मे अल्लाह ब्लेस यू ऑल एंड बी मर्सीफुल अपॉन अस ऑल आमीन ए अल्लाह Oh Allah please accept my prayers Look I'm going to take you today to allotment and keep you with me all day long I enjoy my time in allotment in gardening and inshallah hopefully you going to like like it as well Yeah because it's an open place You just ignore me and you know I look amazing blue and white clouds sun rising sun setting bird charming and people working in their plots all day just goes by and we don't want to come home because we feel relaxed and happy slowly, in allotment Like a Other thing, while you are in allotment, you enjoy you your time. When you you enjoy your time, or and all the worries, all the pains, or illness, just you forget. As you breathing fresh air, fresh oxygen produced by plants, and this is an open big place, you feel relaxed automatically. like sometimes what happen when you are very hungry or very thirsty you can't focus on other jobs that much but when you had food you had to drink and you feel uh, better you can uh, and you are feeling well as well you can do other jobs uh, good as well so you know if you breathe the oxygen fresh oxygen from the plants and look at the greenery it boost your energy it make you feel relaxed it extend your life make your health better it is same like a food fresh oxygen is very very important especially in this uh covid situation if it's nice weather try to come out and just uh, take care of yourself and your family don't um, get get too close to in the gathering and you enjoy your time in parks in uh, allotment in uh, uh, riverside walks or anywhere else because most of the shops are closed and people are bored they can't go school they people can't go for jobs they work and they are stuck at home and the frustrations been built aloud lots of argument going on because people are bored at home nothing to do if you come out and about not just you feel yourself happy and relaxed your own family enjoy as well children or older people young or uh, any age everybody love nature and nature is a uh, beautiful allah god almighty made this beautiful universe for all human being we should appreciate and we should enjoy the most and we should take care of each other as well try not to make uh, somebody upset don't uh, speak or well with everyone don't hurt anybody's feeling and enjoy uh, and look at the nature if you focus on the basic things you actually training your children to look for basic and basics are important and uh, good look this is uh, 
zaffron plant the orange uh, bed is a zaffron if you pinch this orange bit and dry on the window cell you got uh, your fresh zaffron to put in milk or in use uh, in sweet rice it is very good it boost your brain energy make you intelligent in old tradition time this is daffodils and it smell very nice the zaffron plant uh, it make you clever as well as if somebody is pregnant uh, they can uh, put uh, zaffron in a milk and uh, drink the milk and your children become healthy and uh, beautiful as well and if you just dissolve the zaffron in a yogurt or in milk and apply on your face your acne uh, become better now look i am in a garden we did all this uh, plot ourselves my husband give me company as well and uh, it is very hard when i come home and sit down my whole body is aching like my legs and my arms just hurt because the ground is soft but is very hard to turn 10 kg soil around and after you turn it around you break this into small small chunk and me i am little bit lazy you know that what i do as i dig i throw some seeds in and level up with the rake so uh, it look nice as well as my plant going to grow the seeds you can plant straight away is hardy seeds like mustard seeds uh, spinach beetroot um rocket leaves all uh, kind of uh, vegetables i just planted in a rows in lines so it, it is easy to um, make this um, and um, harvest cut the vegetable look this beautiful moon the side the funny thing when you focus on the nature and explore the world you see beautiful world look the sun setting is in the west and the moon is rising in the east in the morning the moon is in the uh, sun rises from the east and moon uh, rise from the um, moon you can see in the uh, morning in the west but uh, at in the evening you can see the sun in the west and the moon in the east and look so amazing lots of birds are charming charming singing songs and making you feel relaxed on these trees and the round bit is actually birds nest and every all the birds goes to home when the sun set look this is all the scenes are in our allotment you know that if you are actually in the place you, it uh, is different but if we, you just uh, try to make video on a mobile only limited um, things uh, you could see but your own i can see on entire uh, area uh, uh, anyway i encourage all my family and friends and youtubers to give your time uh, and feel happy and relax can you see with my spade i'm trying to um, dig the sides of my allotment so i can uh, plant some strawberries ra raspberries and i it, it is easy to get uh, from the side instead of uh, stepping in i can uh, find something green in here oh look there is a green bag coming out from the oh my god <laughs> that's that's nice there is something else i can see the green bag is uh, we can't find this green bag from here this is somewhere else look these are coconut shells the sun is setting from other side everything uh, it looks like big uh, light 
the sun lights coming up is that of me oh my god look at my god precious things oh my god that's so nice these are small small pieces no small the some are quite big pieces of you know that g o l d yeah i am a millionaire i am so happy oh look what i found i was taking the ground and i just felt something is just uh, blocking my spade and when i cleared it was green bag in the green bag underneath there was a, this pot it is a uh, unusual uh, pot and there was coconut in and i just turn it around and it's all kind of coins and all small small pieces gold oh my god i'm going to take this home and i'm going to wash and i'm going to see actually what is this and it is gold i'm going to rub this on piece of uh, um some uh, solid piece like um, stone and if you leave the color that's mean is real gold and if you if this is stick to uh, magnet that's mean this is no gold and if it doesn't stick to the um, magnet that's mean is uh, no um, um, iron it is actually gold so after i done two three experiments i'm going to put some chemical on to see if it's gold then i'm going to use the magnet and i'm going to put in the hot water and i am going to i rugged it just rub it on the slate the sto stones uh, slate and if we leave the uh, line that means this is a gold and it is like oh my god 250 gram i'm going to keep this somewhere safe so <laughs> i have to cover this hole so oh my god you know in britain if you find something like this you supposed to take to the government and you need to uh, let local authority know they will take away from you and they might give you some kind of prize um but they going to put this in a museum and even they going to announce in this uh, newspaper that this thing happened but in if i keep myself i am going to be a millionaire i am going to be a millionaire yeah oh well done all right everybody go to gardens and dig the gardens but you find something as well Oh my god I don't know how excited I feel and how can I uh, um stop I am going to throw a party but I'm not going to tell anyone but you know don't please don't 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 tell anyone I'm going to just digest slowly like nothing happened okay this is a big secret I'm sharing with you look oh my god now i'm going to see this is my my idea if it's real gold promise one third or one fourth um quarter to it i'm going to give to the charity i'm going to not keep all for myself i'm going to give some to the charity as well i can see something else as well look this bag is uh, blocking this uh, place as well i have to pull it out might i find something here as well yeah you know what i set up my camera there so i can show my uh, youtube friend, family and friends how i dig first i found that now i don't know what i'm expecting oh look 
this is very hard ground i have to dig you know one thing i want to tell you this spade is really really good and worth to buy please please if you doing gardening or anything else just spend money in good things first somebody suggest go buy the spades and folks from uh, bn bn and m and after a little while it become rusty it stop working properly we bought these uh, spades and forks from wilkinson it was like a 15 pound each 30 pound i spent on two things but as you carry on digging it become sharper uh, it be do not become rusty and uh, it become uh, very useful and light otherwise the other one make you feel have very um, unhappy and is hard to dig that's why please whenever you buy any tools sewing machine cooking cooking things saucepan please 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 don't waste ma money on cheap stuff just uh, look for quality and quality always worth so uh, when, whenever i uh, learn something myself I uh, share all the ideas, all the good thing with my YouTube family and friends, so they can benefit as well as me. So I keep these are my uh, uh, handy tools. I've got plenty other uh, tools in my shed, but these two uh, fork and spade is really really useful uh, uh, to use uh, and uh, do digging. If you can't do digging then you can't grow uh, things the, uh, well because it's, uh, uh, it is a beginning of uh, spring this is the ideal time to dig all the ground if you have some uh, place in your garden dig, uh, dig it out uh, bury the home compost underneath the ground so mouse don't come and your ground become so um, uh, fertilizer so uh, useful for plants even your three handful of uh, spinach seed is going to uh, grow amazing there is something plastic coming out from the corner oh there is nothing i'll move the bag there is nothing underneath so what you do you buy the nice tools use it well and enjoy enjoy working some people uh, my uh, family friends told me there are sale in this um, store and so spends are so cheap and this and that and i said no i don't need it when i need to go go and buy i spend money and sometimes my husband said oh you spend too much money but later on is worth to spend money for example i bought some copper uh, saucepan it is three layers saucepan it's non-stick it is for lifetime lifetime guarantee and queen's uh, kitchen these dishes kind of uh, kind of dishes uh, uh, they use i bought from T tk max and, and in TK Max, it was like a 60 pound. One was uh, 80 pound, half price 40 pound. And one was uh, uh, like a 60 pound, I bought for 30 pound. I spent like a 30 and 40, 70 pound I spent in total. One dish, big one, I kept for my daughter. And one we used at home to make a coke, uh, popcorns, to boil the uh, things and make the food you know small um, uh, amount of food we can cook there and it's non-stick and i enjoy nearly two years now i enjoy every day the pan and nothing happened to it so if you buy a cheap one it start burning your food and it is no good after a couple of months or year you throw it away but uh, if you've got less uh, things but nice one it is uh, worth to buy because less is more less is more uh, try to get good quality stuff and look look after them and use it well don't throw it away recycle 
so i hope you enjoy uh, the sun side setting is getting dark people start packing their uh, stuff and they going home and i set up my camera there is all the sun setting you can see it been uh, automatically uh, been recorded from my camera on um, tripod so that's uh, you the, uh, the things you are enjoying and if you see uh, um, very uh, nicely you can see the clouds moving as well but i don't know much about the youtube he uh, my daughter's uh, sometime i need my daughter's help she uh, she knows more than me and if i make it this faster you could see the clouds moving but she was uh, tired after working so i did not ask her so <laughs> the sun is going down and while i was uh, this was recording i was digging ground and i'm going to pack after a little while and i'm going to go home i wait until other people are working in the ground as well in the fields and if i see everybody is going then i go as well because it is open place public place and your health and safety is in your hand you need to consider um, as a lady you should not be out and about after sun setting after maghrib you should go home and be safe and healthy so this is a scene of my allotment i hope you're going to enjoy if you if you think this is a great effort to record and do my allotment please give me thumb up and share with your family and friends and press the bell icon button so my vlogs become uh, you can see my vlogs straight away because i noticed some of my vlogs being deleted by self and myself because i don't want to have lots of vlogs are not decent one but um i better um, share with you so this is the scene of my allotment and the sun is setting in near the school side the school my daughter uh, attended it is primary school now my other children going there it is really really good school and uh, alhamdulillah our area is packed with all the facilities the shops are nearby schools are nearby local shops uh, city center uh, you call we sell town center is just 5 7 minute, minutes away train station is just 5 uh, minutes away hospital is in other side it just like a 5 10 minutes you can uh, reach all the places and your your house is in the middle and we uh, my uh, sister call my area feet of london if your feet is uh, no strong how you going to stand up and how you going to walk and how you going to work my sister call this area and uh, feet of london and whenever we want to reach london we go in busy life of london and when we just want want to enjoy country life village life we just come to our town so we are um, in between so luton is uh, just up, uh, next to us luton milton keynes the people who live in britain and uh, they know where, where we live but uh, all over the world people don't uh, know our area they are not familiar with this area because the big cities uh, their name they know and small uh, cities they don't know you know that if it is a city it should be airport in a and if there is no airport then it does not call a city um for example the oldest town in britain is hadsfield is very very big is 17 areas of one um, uh, town because it's a town with a hillside there it cannot be built uh, airport airport is in a leeds 
in manchester in bradford in uh, liverpool all around but there is no airport in, in this uh, there is a university so if he, you call some somewhere city it should have airport universities railways bus station shop so, uh, shopping centers um banks and all uh, kind of facilities to give the title of city and if is one of them is missing they cannot get, um, name the city now luton is a city is a london uh, they call london luton that's why bedford is next to it and if the people call this uh, uh, bedford london so alhamdulillah the weather was so nice early in the morning uh, i planned i planned what to do i just make a list of the things i'm going to do today uh, my husband uh, done some barbecue and we roast some sweet potato we cook the food clean home because uh, when is raining and weather is no nice you are all the time at home you can do all the jobs uh, anyway but when weather is nice you like to go out and you like to do shopping and you like to do gardening stuff look the cloud is so amazing yeah hopefully you're going to enjoy this vlog and if you enjoy please uh, let me know in comment section comment section your comments are very very important to me and uh, sometime uh, i read and do for example my one of her youtube friend ask me when you do digging or planting the seeds please make a vlog and share with us yesterday i did that um with in the request of uh, my friend so your um, um comments are very um, precious and very important i'm very very thankful for all my brothers and sisters all over the world uh, who likes and support my channel and uh, please uh, stay safe and happy and if i can do something better please uh, suggest me in comment section and if i do something good please uh, uh, encourage and i pray for you and you pray for me and we can spend our life in um, with good manners and good akhlaq with happiness and we we'll take care of each other because this is a uh, youtube is um, my ambition and um, i enjoy doing it and i enjoy sharing the information whatever i know little bit i want to show uh, share with my brothers and sisters so you you um, share your ideas and your hobbies and your um, things too inshallah and um, inshallah we uh, can enjoy our life people think that everything is money if the children are studying from the beginning ask them what you want to do, uh, do when you grow old answer is we want to be a doctor to earn money we want to be an engineer to earn money we need to be a teacher to earn money money is no everything money is a need of the time like a food clothes house these are basic things we need but with the money you can buy this all but money is, should not be our uh, main issue if we, people open the youtube if they is focusing on uh, they just want to get money sorry this is no good platform form for them and if you have ambition to do something and you like doing it you enjoy it is a hobby this is my and other hobby my hobby is gardening walk going for walk and talking and uh, now our days youtube you know that and uh, if it is a hobby just to like take like a hobby and you have other jobs to do as well other duties to do as well so i hope you going to enjoy my this vlog please if you 
um, enjoy it. I am not going to ask a share with someone, especially this vlog, because I showed you some sensitive bit. And until I become clear, I'm not going to say share with anyone. Please just watch and give me, uh, tell me in comment section. And the person is no greedy. The person I uh, nobody can buy me. Uh, I, um, nobody can just. I, I don't uh, focus on uh, money. Money is nothing for me. Money is just the thing. So even the yellow sun setting cloud you could see if it's a full of gold, I don't care. I'm not crazy. Um, if mountain full of golds, it's okay. Is that thing? If, um, money and uh, um, gold is no food you need to uh, eat and survive. So I don't know why people just go for uh, money and uh, this is beautiful sun setting you could see and enjoy be thankful appreciate what you have all the time appreciate whatever you have don't be greedy what you don't have and if you see something other people have and you don't have so don't worry one time you're going to have that thing but if you just carry on forgetting whatever you have and just looking at oh, oh people got this and people got this you, you're going to make your life very hard you're going to make your life harder to live and you're going to punish yourself um, anyway so try not to copy anyone don't follow other people just be happy whatever you have and enjoying it, enjoy it best with your family and with your friend and people around you. Take care of them. They will take care of you. You are nothing alone. And we have been created, all human beings are for each other. And we are brothers and sisters. And we need to stick together. Take care of our other needs and others' feelings. And don't hurt anyone. Appreciate whatever we have. And this is a strong message for all, from Desi BP to my all you, to your to your family and friends. Please, please let me know what uh, I did wrong in this uh, uh, vlog. And if you suggest anything, please uh, tell me in the comment. Thank you for watching. Thank you very much.